ShireSociety.com. Ridley here at the intersection of 101 and 114 in Bedford. As indicated, I finally got around to doing a one-man sine wave for NH exit. Standing right over there, you can just sort of imagine me being there. Over a four-minute period, I counted uh, an average of one honk per minute aimed at me. Didn't get any negative response at all. It looked like uh, about 83 vehicles passed me in a two-minute period that I counted at random uh, and, and passed in such a way that they could see the, the URL. Now, I'm not sure how many people were in each vehicle, but it's probably safe to guess that uh, we could uh, average out, uh, you know, maybe one person per vehicle uh, would have actually looked at the sign. So uh, I guess that makes for about 41 per minute. This is one of the best intersections in New Hampshire for this sort of thing, but it'd be better to do it on uh, one of the uh, overpasses above Route 3 in Nashua. Those are, yeah, I think you get a lot more views quickly. It's not a very good uh, location in terms of, you know, people stopping and talking to you because uh, it's, hard, it's hard for people to get close to you or to really pull over. But uh, at least three people did stop and kind of ask me questions. And uh, one of them seemed like a cop who recognized me who didn't want to admit to watching the channel. <laughs> I'd like to request, if I may, that others of you uh, do something similar, maybe in better locations if you can find them. Uh, just one man protest. I, I really, you know, there's support uh, out there for this. I can feel it. It's just that there's not a lot of activism out there for it. Uh, so get out there and, and uh, put our URL out there if you can, or one that's better if there is one. I've been meaning to get a New Hampshire flag uh, just because I think that the, the Gadsden flag is perceived as sort of a right-leaning or right-wing flag, and this isn't really a right-wing endeavor, but uh, I haven't gotten around to buying one yet, uh, not another one anyway, maybe a taller flagpole or whatnot. Rich Paul has some great ideas for devices which could hold signs or act as sort of low budget mannequins uh, and help him if you can. The old world is collapsing and it's going to take its slave driver governments with it. But what will rise up in their place? In New Hampshire, the Shire Society has a plan, a thriving web forum and a history of action. He didn't take long to come up with a plan. You can sign up right now at ShireSociety.com.